Hi, Hi. we're Bombinos. I'm Joey. I'm Paolo. We originally started Bombinos because we just wanted to bring in wines that we love. Yeah. And as we introduced those wines to more and more people, we realized that at the heart of Bombinos was really making wines more fun and accessible for all people. So natural wine could be also interpreted as uh, wines that are made with minimal to low intervention. What that essentially means is that it's basically fermented grape juice and essentially wine made with its truest and most honest form. Quite recently, we've expanded our portfolio from natural wines into mezcal from Mexico. The reason we got into mezcals is, well, first of all, we just like them, we like the taste. But secondly, we find them really interesting. If you look at the world of mezcal, it's pretty much like the world of wine. In terms of just like the variety of tastes, flavors, and experiences, it's just so diverse and rich. So today, we are using Madre Mezcal to make our take on a margarita that we call the Manila Bay. We are using mezcal, calamansi liqueur, we're still using limes as a reliable base. We will have simple syrup, but we're adding an extra ingredient of olive juice to make it dirty. Cut your limes, which I already did earlier. Whatever squeezer you have or whatever device you have to get the juice out of the limes, and you just squeeze the juice out, as I'm doing right here. So this is my summer cocktail of choice. As I mentioned, I love um, mezcal. I could also have tequila-based um, cocktail as well. I do love just agave taste. It just goes really well with our climate and with our food especially. So I would say it would go well with like lumpia, it would go well with even adobo, um, it would go well with caldereta. So now that we have our six halves of lime juice in here, we're going to add one ounce of calamansi liqueur, like so. Then we're going to add two ounces of our mezcal. And then we are going to add two teaspoons of simple syrup. I like mine extra dirty, so when it comes to the olive juice, I'm gonna add two teaspoons. You wanna throw some ice in here to make sure as you're shaking it up, it gets nice and cold. And then all you have to do is give it a little shake. And then, just pour it up. Mmm, now it's perfect. So cheers, enjoy your Manila Bay at home. So we're gonna make a quick snack. Uh, it's called roasted shishito peppers to go with the uh, Manila Bay drink that Joey is uh, making for us. For this recipe, you'll just need a few ingredients. Of course, you need shishito peppers, extra virgin olive oil, sea salt, togarashi flakes, uh, and a couple lemons. Grab the shishito peppers, uh, put it in like a mixing bowl or a mixing tray. And then you'll want to coat these with the extra virgin olive oil. So we chose to make this dish because it's quite convenient to make a uh, quick snack that will pair well with the Manila Bay cocktail. You want to make sure your pan is nice and hot before you add some oil and the peppers on it. Just want to add just a little bit since the shishito peppers are already coated with extra virgin olive oil. Here it's sizzling, it means the pan is nice and hot. Kind of dump it all in there. Keep it on the pan so you see some of the skin start to blister. It's about maybe like five to six minutes. If you can't find it, maybe just go for your normal um, kind of like bell peppers. Those would kind of work for you as well. The jalapenos that we have here locally tend to be not super spicy. So if you have a bit of tolerance, that could be a good substitute. Um, now that the shishito peppers are nice and blistered, you can move it now to your serving tray where you start to garnish it with the salt, uh, lemon zest, and uh, lemon juice as well to finish. Add a bit of the togarashi flakes, with, which has sesame seeds. Uh, to give it that extra kick and uh, robust flavor. And then you're done. Um, taste it, you can see if there's enough salt. Yeah, really good. So now we are enjoying um, Paolo's beautiful plated uh, shishito pepper. <laughs> it goes quite well with Joey's Manila Bay. It's really good. Cheers. Cheers, man. If you're interested to try some of our stuff, you can check out bombinos.com. We have a wide selection of natural wines from over the world. Yeah. And we have our mezcals as well. 
happy to actually invite you guys over. We're opening up a space soon. It's going to be somewhere in Makati. Uh, details to follow, but yeah, we're excited to have you guys and we're really excited to, to open this space because it's another milestone to celebrate with all of you.